I think one of the truest battles that you have in life and from day to day is that there's going to be beautiful things in your day and beautiful and or meaningful things in your day and beautiful and or meaningful things over the course of the days that you've had, over the life that you've had, that should be appreciated or that are special. But every day, there's things that come into your path that threaten to pull your focus towards it, to this challenging thing or frustrating thing or whatever, that will take away your remembrance of beautiful things, of meaningful things that have happened in your life, in my life, in the country's history. Like, so maybe it's not even just a person thing. Like, even as a, even if you want to look at it as like history of a country or history of the world or history of a city or, <coughs> but so that's one of the truest battles is to, to not let frustrations or anxieties or challenges or upsets rob the beauty the beauty and meaningfulness in each day and over the course of your life like there's some maybe there's something beautiful that happened in like fifth grade for you that like it's just kind of sleeping like it happened <coughs> and maybe it's maybe it's like technically accessible in your memory but like there's <coughs> like other things going on that are capturing your attention that like pull you from being able to remember something from like fifth grade like every day there's things calling for your attention good and bad and like those and if your attention is pulled towards certain things then you might be pulled away from other things so it might be hard it might be especially hard to remember beauty or meaningful things that have happened over the course of your life when there's things happening right now today <coughs> but those things deserve to be remembered might it might empower you then at the same time there's stuff that like that could happen today that could be super meaningful or powerful and if you're not present enough which i'm not very i don't think i'm good at being present but i more so live in the past but if you're not present enough to digest it, dance with it, experience it, it's not going to be in your memory because you didn't experience it. Or maybe there's some event going on that if you would have gone to it, that would have been like a significant memory, like a keeper of an experience. But because you didn't go to it, you don't get to log that. You don't get to have that. So, yeah. One of the truest battles is to not let... Anxieties, fears, worries, challenges, the challenging stuff rob you of the beauty and meaningfulness of today and of different points of your life that you've accrued or that you've experienced and should be remembered.